distracting. I'm going to start off with a poem. It's called Strong. Strong. A word that brings no true comfort. I mean, what are you trying to say? I get tired too. Do you want to see the scars that are black and blue? When I asked you for help, that took some courage. From few may answer out of sympathy, while others will say, you're strong, you'll figure it out. What's wrong with getting some help? Where is my child who understand? My silence does not mean we beef it, we still fool. People who understand when I've done all I can, I may fall. My request for your assistance is my final option. I do not expect you to tell anyone else about it. When I confess my desires to give up, I am not weak, I am fed up. My words of, wait, words of encouragement to keep you going. Your persistence to validate my feelings is so fucking mean. We fall down, but we get up, did not mean that I was invincible. If God needed another hand, he would have created one. He added that to his plans. I am man, a woman. I break too. Strong also looks like self-care and saying no, getting every up, getting up every day, and letting the tears flow. Sometimes the hope you have is the real group. Hope. Mm. My next poem, um, just a little brief thing about it. It's just about not waiting for people to tell you how great you are, mm -hmm. knowing how great you are, thinking how great you are, standing on that. So that's what this poem is about. I actually just wrote it right before I got here. So. Yes. 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 All right, guys. People don't always give me my flowers, so I take them. I make them gravitate towards me, and they'll have no choice but to accept me. Those who can't handle it will flee. But most, most, most of them will open their eyes so brightly. I am walking bloody. I'm a little shy, but I can only hide my goofy and uplifting side for too long. It's embedded in me. Before you know it, I've opened the doors to change your only imagining your sleep. You have taken the biggest steps in the direction of your calling. I know this is real arrogant to say, but it is true though. I have watched it play out so many times, but I still have a question if my soil had the right treatment. The truth shall set me free. I take my flowers. I plant my own roots. I am the sun. Woo! All right, so this is another one, just a general poem. Um, it's for people of all races, anybody um, who just feel like they have some general support curses going on in their family. Maybe you feel like you're the one trying to break them, your mom is trying to break them, Come your kids are going to be the one trying to break them. I feel like I'm currently the one trying to break mine and my family. So this is the poem that I wrote about that. The blood we share does not keep me bound. With my ancestor's strength that gives me power, I would, I would say, excuse my language, when I say this, but fuck this. Your ways may be genetic, but I am the one that stands out. I am no longer interested in the ways that we share. I am not better than you, but I can be better than the ways and the ways that we pass down to my children and theirs. We talk a lot about fear, but denial is another big one. It's been in our faces for so long. The refusal to see won't get the best of me. See, everything isn't all my fault, but for what it is, I take accountability. The truth is, you started way before me. When the torch lit up to the sky, I will put out the flames. I will be the reason for so many things. Like the flawed belief that things are okay. Don't try to take my credit away. Like my last name, Justice, I search for ways to free those in need, even when it's me. How can you keep doing the same thing? It sounds like insanity. The blood we share won't keep me around because I need me. I need me more than anyone to achieve all the victories of the ones before me, especially you. Family is just is not just a word, but it has some value. I have generational curses on my back. Oh. Yeah, 
I wanted love like Monica and Quincy. Playing a game for a man's heart hasn't turned out so great. Love like Nina and Darius, that type of love that makes you get on stage and claim love out loud. You are the only one in the crowd, that love that isn't afraid to say your name. Chills in my chills in my bones and in my spine. Taking vows like J and B, singing lemonade still hasn't set me free. Getting the best of me, unlike Maya who said it with her chest, I will be next. Love like Tina and Ike. I mean, not everyone knew Tina's home was a cage. We knew strength was when you stay. It's easy to stay when you share someone else's face. Love like Sydney and Dre, old school rap. Walks for hot dogs in the park, chilling on the block, brown sugar type of love. Love like Uncle Phil and Aunt Deb. Love that keeps families together. Heaven on earth, love like 90s love. Let reality sink in. And those movies were not realities. Welcome to 2024. Oh.